those who do survive the trip end up here, the most notorious detention center in Australia. 17,000 asylum seekers have been processed here in the last four years. Television cameras have never been allowed inside the detention center until now. So this is our medical facility from Northwest Point. We have lots of, uh, not lots of, but we have several threats of self-harm, I suppose, when they're frustrated. And presumably, unfortunately, some fatalities as well. There have been some fatalities in immigration detention facilities. Yeah. A lot of people, they hurt themselves. They uh, committed suicide, some guys. There was one guy, he was 19 years old. He hanged himself. Hmm. In the past four years, there have been nine deaths in Australian detention centres. So far, three have been confirmed suicides. How long have you been here? 19 months. 19 months? We are refugees. Only wait. Wait? Yes. You just have to wait. wait. How do you feel about that? Not good? Uh, Bad, yeah. I know you don't like waiting, <laughs> but otherwise, is the food good, comfortable, no food, no gym, no internet. It's not important. Yeah, okay. We understand that. I, I, we do I, understand I came that. here about Ferida, yes? Yeah. It is important that it is the place is properly run, that's all. Why, why some people go, uh, go outside uh, in uh, two months, three months, four months, but some people here have been a long time. I'm very depressed. I'm, I I'm not good. Help us. Too many people uh, lost, uh, lost anything in uh, their country. Please help me. It's people living and dying, and I will not ever put my name to a policy that allows people to crash against those rocks.